You've heard of quiet cars on trains. What about mask cars? CBS 2's Meg Baker says there's a commuter advocate who's asking NJ Transit, just think about, to consider the possibility of cars for passengers who prefer to be among the masked if the federal mandate is dropped for good. Masks are required on all trains right now, but the future is unclear. Adam Reich, a commuter advocate, is asking NJ Transit officials to consider implementing one mask car per train. The idea here would be that anybody riding in the designated mask car would have to keep their face covering on, you know, mouth, nose, covered, no eating or drinking. Um, anybody who does not want to mask could simply use the rest of the train. The commuter advocate says the quiet car is a model for the mass car. There's no cell phone talking. If you speak, it's supposed to be at a low volume. So there is a precedent for this New Jersey transit already has designated cars for special purposes. Commuters we spoke to all seem to agree. I think that sounds like a good idea. It gives people the option so they don't have to you know, be by somebody not in a mask. I just think everybody's making different decisions, and I think, you know, people that are more immune compromised and uh, would just feel safer. I think it's a good idea. I think a lot of people are ready to get rid of them, but there are always going to be a handful of people that will still want them. When I asked NJ Transit directly about the mask car idea, leadership would only issue this generic statement. There are no plans to extend the mask mandate once the federal mandate expires. However, masks will remain optional, and we encourage all those who wish to continue to wear them to do so, if that provides for a more comfortable travel experience. There's a greater level of protection when everybody in that environment is masked, and I think the mask car can accomplish that. Reich says with the rising number of COVID cases, it's a legit concern that should be considered for those who are high risk or live with someone who is, but have no other choice than public transportation. In New Jersey, Meg Baker, CBS 2 News. NJ Transit says it will continue to follow state and federal guidance. What do you think? Is the mask car a good idea? Take the poll on our website, cbsnewyork.com.